Chili, say hi. Say hi to all the subscribers. Say what's up, guys. We're happy to have you back. Got another video coming your way here in just a minute, but we are happy. I know it looks like I'm trying to escape and get away from this camera, but I'm just doing that to be silly. What is up, guys? Check it out. Sporting the new Planet Chinchilla t-shirt here. Tried to find one matching for Chili, but apparently these guys overheat a little bit. That's a joke. But that would be really cool if I could find her a matching shirt without her overheating. But today, guys, we are coming to you with a special video. We've got her out just for one of her, couple of her weekly dust baths here. And the video I wanna make is specific to, sorry, she's like nibbling my ankles. Get her on her dust bath here real quick for you guys. This is becoming like the new video set. She just tends to do some fun stuff whenever we come down here in the playpen with her dust bath and her oats. Her three favorite things on the planet. No, I do not fall as one of those three. It's her dust bath, her oats, and this playpen. But anyways, guys, <clears throat> fittingly enough with the oats being out, that's what this video is about, is giving your chinchilla oats. Should you be doing it? Obviously, it's probably okay since I'm doing it for this video. But we are going to cover what you need to know about it and some of the common questions that people ask. So stick around for just a minute and we'll be right back. Guys, real quick, as I say in every one of our videos, me and Chili would greatly appreciate if you like this content to hit that subscribe button down below, hit that thumbs up down below, hit that notification button down below and drop any comments for us that you have. If you need a video made about a specific topic, we would love to make it for you. So make sure you are communicating with us through the means necessary down below and we would love to hear from you. Otherwise, let's start talking about these guys eat notes and what you need to know. She's on my lap right now, but I'm gonna go ahead and start talking. Moral of the story with this video, guys, is yes, oats are perfectly safe for chinchillas. Not a big deal. These are just dried oats that you can get at the store. She is obsessed with them compared to all of the other treats and things that you can get for a chinchilla to snack on, nibble on, whatever they wanna do. This is her favorite. Typically, I use this playpen specifically for videos and that is because, in my opinion, it is just really difficult to shoot a video on these guys running around a big room. The basement at my house is set up for her to play in, and yes, I do use it for that, but not when I'm shooting a video, because then I gotta keep up with her. If she goes under even a little end table, then it's hard to get the footage. So using this playpen that I talk about in separate videos, I'll link them in the description below, just makes it easier. So if you guys are getting mad that you're seeing the same scenery all the time including my face let us know in that description below and we'll change it up for you but for now this works i get awesome footage of her and we're going to stick with it all right back to being on topic about these oats guys so these guys are basic old-fashioned quaker oats they're just dried oats not a big deal they can eat them right out of your hand jelly come here do something cool for the camera make it look like i have you trained Anyways, they are safe, guys. You don't want to be overloading them with oats all the time. I mean, they still need to be eating their Timothy hay. They still need to be eating their pellets. But oats is a treat, or oats is a mechanism to get them to kind of do what you want them to do. Is She's literally on top of the camera right now. She's like, let me take over, guys. I can do this way better than him. But, yeah, guys, uh, oats as a primary treat source for these guys is absolutely fine no issues at all i'm trying to make sure she doesn't jump out of here so i have to chase her she just climbed up on my shoulders but yeah guys go for it now when it comes to other forms of oats you can certainly use those too you don't have to limit it to just these quaker oats so when it comes to the kind of oats you can use i would honestly just stick with the quaker oats if you want to use other kinds of oats you certainly can but i've never had any issues using the ones that I'm showing here in this video. She's always been receptive to them. She's always liked them. She's never had any, you know, pooping, diarrhea issues, anything like that. And she always gets just as eager to eat more of them. So that would be my recommendation. And in all honesty, I would just stick with oats as a primary treat source in general for these guys, because there's no use in 
risking other fruits and vegetables that you may not know if they're gonna upset their stomach or not. Sticking to something you know works with a chinchilla when it, when it comes to treats or miscellaneous food items is always the best way to go in my opinion because they do have those sensitive digestive tracts right in this little belly here, don't you? And there's just no need to risk it if you're not 100% familiar with what you're doing or if you don't wanna take the time to sit there and consult a vet over it. it just makes life a lot easier. So consider that. Consider oats an awesome, awesome way to make your chinchilla happy, to give them a treat, and to have an ep economical way to have treats on hand at all times. I mean, oats are cheap, guys. It, it would be an easy way to get a huge container of these to use them whenever you want for your chinchilla compared to some of those other, you know, specialty items you can find elsewhere from, you know, the chinchilla dedicated websites, even from the pet store, if they're considered safe, whatever the case may be, oats are likely going to be one of the cheapest ways that you can always have a ton of treats on hand that your chinchilla loves and one that you don't have to worry about what it's going to do to their digestive systems. It's my go-to. It's what I use all the time. So I would definitely say that it's safe. I would use it. They're going to love it. Chili, say hi. Say I'm out in my playpen today, guys. Okay. Or don't say hi. Just sit there. <laughs> All right, guys. I usually try and make these videos with as much content as I can, but today's video was based on a simple question, if these guys can eat oats or not. So it kind of made it difficult to get a ton of footage here for you. She's you know, only out for a little bit right now. She's gonna go back after her dust bath is done. I am glad we got to at least show you the new Planet Chinchilla shirts that we got going on here. In general, they can have the oats. That's about all we have for you. Man, she's making my life difficult right now on camera. She's trying to like navigate her way out of the playpen. All right, guys, that is all I have for you on this topic about if chinchillas can eat oats. Again, if you guys find this content useful, please be sure to subscribe down below, hit that notification button, leave us a comment if you have anything, like the video, and we will catch you guys next Thursday. That's when new videos come out. Make sure you're around for those by using that notification bell, and we will see you guys again next time. Thanks for stopping by.